that cold. You know, uh, as the great Southern poet DJ once said in Hustle and Flow, it's not the size of the dog in the fight, but it's the size of the fight in the dog, man. Throughout the course of my football career, I wasn't always the biggest, the fastest, or the strongest on the field, but I was always the most competitive. And as a coach of a 9 and 10-year-old Saramon T-Birds, we often found ourselves facing adversity. But as competition always brought, me, brought the best out of me, I've tried passing those lessons off to the next generation in the latest installment of the original series, NFL 4. <laughs> What football did for me and changed my family's life forever. So and obviously that's the main thing that I try to tell kids is if you really love this game and you really give it everything you have, then it'll change your life forever. Touchdown! Maurice Jones drew with a huge play. I coach the junior Pee Wee team, the San Ramon Thunderbirds or San Ramon T-Birds. We prefer to call them more swaggy. Ready? Ready? My oldest son's on there, Deuce. Go ahead, Deuce, go. Get up to him. Good job. Both of you guys, good job. This group is like real confident, real funny, and they compete. There you go, go get it. Rule number one is protect your team, protect your teammates. But rule number two is compete. Fly out and make a tackle. <laughs> There we go, good job. We play music in practice, celebrate, we do all the little things that you should do at this age to encourage kids to keep playing. It's fun, and I like playing because I just like getting the ball and scoring touchdowns. We did enough work this week to win, but you guys have to decide. Do you want to tackle on Saturday? Do you want to block on Saturday? Do you want to score touchdowns on Saturday? All right, so what are we going to do on Saturday? Are we going to decide to win or no? Yeah. All right, good, good, good. Good morning, buddy. Blue day. Tyler Taos is an exceptional player. He wants to know why we're doing everything, which I love about him. And he pushes us as coaches to be better. Thank you. All right, you need crunching power, Tyler. You're going to be a tough team. Yeah. Football's just, not just a fun sport to play. It's a sport to become a man and a sport to make you more mature. Going past six on two. There we go, get out of there! Listen, we're in a dog fight, but we've been here before. We gotta get to the ball. Oh, 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 there we go! Good job, Tyler. There we go! Listen, guys, you can't win them all. But overall, I thought you guys competed with your butts off. It's a good team. Let's not look down. Don't put your heads down. This is a good game. I'm really proud of you. It doesn't matter win or lose. We're still going to be a team rather it's improving and fixing our mistakes. They're better than I expected, but it's not just about on the field. It's about off the field, too. You need to keep your grades up. Don't act back in school. With all the stuff that's going on in our world, to see 19 year old boys who come from different areas support each other, care for each other, that's what our team is all about. And I think our kids really enjoy those moments. And you just kind of create that friendship. So, you know, that's what goes longer than wins and losses. More in shaping and molding the next generation. Good oh, old stuff. But uh, Thurman Thomas, he cares nothing about the T-Birds oh. because he's all about himself right about here. He says, I'm on the edge of my seat waiting because he is the next person who will be on a football life. That's right. He's presented by Sprint. He's so excited. Let's give him a sneak peek. All these running backs that got picked in front of me, 